Hey guys, Desolator Magic here, and it's officially October, which means I guess it's fall. I, I doubt fall actually starts on October 1st, too lazy to check, who cares? But the weather apparently found out it was October and drastically changed. So now it's uh, sweaters and pumpkin spice everywhere, everywhere you look. So I thought instead of doing a cheese review like I normally do, which I, I feel like that sentence even isn't that normal, we're going to switch over to candy reviews. Oh yes. Let me just say, in these tough, tough times of 2020, with all the division and and different people with different opinions, and the election coming up. We got the wildfires. I mean, it's just a disaster. One thing that I think we can all come together as mankind to agree on is what what is this? What the heck is this? Why did they do this? It's popcorn-flavored M&Ms. I mean, I saw these at the gas station. I'm like, no. No, they, they almost went too far with the pretzel ones. The hazelnut ones are terrible. I mean, the peanut ones, th those have been around for like 50 years. It makes sense. Put peanuts in candy, whatever. But now popcorn. It's not even real popcorn. It, it even says artificial flavors right under popcorn. I mean, come on. And by the way, share size? Yeah, in your dreams. So let's just jump into it. There we go. All right, what do they look like? They probably look like M&Ms. Let me just, uh, oops, I don't think I have a way of breaking this open other than, uh, there we go. Okay, I'm going to give you the initial impression while also showing the inside. So you can see it's, uh, you know, I don't think I got enough of it. I'm not tasting much here. But it's, it's your average uh, puffy, I believe it's rice-based, if I remember reading this correctly. Oh, I'm just get a fistful of these. Oh, I'm getting a little bit now. They really do smell like popcorn, but, okay, here we go. I mean, I'm mostly getting chocolate. That's pretty much just m and m There's a little bit of popcorn there. I went for that aftertaste, and honestly, that there, there is, there's more popcorn smell than there is popcorn taste. It's really subtle. Let me try a smaller amount. I'm not getting anything but chocolate. The the whole, I mean, it's it's Hershey's chocolate. It's a very strong, like, buttery, oily chocolate with a ton of sugar crammed into it, and a little bit less of like a more subtle cocoa flavor. And it's so strong. I'm not getting any popcorn whatsoever. But somebody said when they opened it, they got a good smell of it. So. I mean, yeah, I can smell a little bit of popcorn smell, but there, there is more smell than flavor. I mean, I've actually had chocolate-coated uh, popcorn like they're showing in the picture there. It really tasted more like popcorn than this does. This is way too subtle. I'll give it another shot. I don't know what I expect to change here. I mean, if somebody handed me these, and I didn't notice that they weighed differently, and, and the, they crunched differently, and they told me to guess what it was, I don't think I'd be able to. That's how subtle it is. If you know you're looking for it, you're like, there's some popcorn flavor there, I just have to pay really close attention. You can kind of get onto it a little bit, but it is just not there. It's way too subtle. I don't think these are going to take off. If, if you compare these two, I don't know if you guys have seen the, uh, the pretzel ones. Oh my gosh, are those good. Those are so much better than this by far, because it's such a strong, salty pretzel, like bready you know, carbohydrate taste. I mean, even now, even like a minute after eating them, I'm getting a little tiny aftertaste of popcorn and that's it. So unless you think candy that smells like popcorn a little bit vaguely while also smelling like candy is a thing that entertains you, I wouldn't bother with these. These are, uh, these are not great. I mean, they taste fine. It's just, what's the point? Just get regular m ups or get the pretzel ones. They're way better. So that is officially Desolator's Candy Review. I might do a couple more of these, but I don't usually buy candy. I'm still kind of trying to lose weight here. But some scientist was like, this right here, this is what we have to do. We have to find a way to artificially make a popcorn flavor and then put it into a candy and then put it in a bag and sell it to people. Not, not like, let's go land on Mars. Not let's, you know, invent a better battery. They're like, oh, Elon Musk is doing that. Let's, let's, let's do this. I feel like if this didn't exist, we'd be on Mars already. This personally, this product individually, if they didn't spend time on this, I'd be on Mars in a bubble. So I'm officially rating the Popcorn M&M's A Humanity is Doomed out of 10. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you next video.